Ever come face to face with a potentially lethal salmon? Obviously, I can't hear you, but I guess you said no. Jeremy Wade has, though, and that's just the start of it for the biologist, extreme angler, and explorer. He joins us now to talk about Animal Planet's mega hit, River Monsters. Good morning, Jeremy. Morning, Mary. Uh, I didn't know salmon could be lethal, uh, but we'll start with this. What are we in for with this new season? Well, um, we're sort of we're sort of switching it up a little bit in this new season. Um, one of the things that I'm doing more than I have done in the past is going into the water. Um, generally, in fresh water, there's not a lot of point getting in because you can't see anything. But on certain occasions, you can. Um, we're also going a little bit more into salt water, coastal water. Uh, we do that up in Alaska. And one of the episodes, um, we travel in time. We go back and take a look at prehistoric river mm. monsters using the magic of CGI and also catching some present day fish which shed light on some of those creatures. How do you know where to find these river monsters? If we look at an equation here, what, what percent is science and then what percent is lore? Oh, it's, it's a mixture of both and my background is, is both. Um, mm. These creatures, you know, they're, they're actually very hard to find, you know, these, these large dangerous fish, um, although, you know, we give the impression from the program that they're everywhere, but if we made a program about going somewhere and not finding it, then nobody's going to watch that. Um, be before I, you know, before I was doing this on TV, I, I spent about 20 years traveling on my own, so I sort of did a lot of the research bef before we we started on TV. Um, recent years, you know, we've we've got a you know we've got researchers who are you know scouring newspapers, the internet, books, what have you. A lot of it, though, is about once on location, just talking to people, and it's mm -hmm. amazing what comes up when you when you talk to people. Then, like you say, you know, it's a case of separating fact from fiction. Uh, particularly people who fish, they're well known for <laughs> exaggerating, right. making things up. So, you know, that that is a factor. <laughs> Uh, which experiences or encounters um, have you had that rattled you the most? And I know at this point that's tougher to do, but what do you re recall the most as being most shocking? Well, uh, one of the things coming up in season seven, um, I was going under the water in Africa, in Botswana, to look at tiger fish. Now, they're quite scary fish. Mm -hmm. They are, they're a bit like scaled up piranhas. But, um, and, and I pick the time of year where, you know, there's a bit of water clarity. The, the other thing, though, that's in the water there, um, as well as the tiger fish, is crocodiles. And normally it would be completely insane to get in the water with crocodiles. Um, being a bi biologist, I know, though, that, you know, crocodiles are, are cold-blooded animals. And if the water temperature is low, the crocs are going to be a bit sluggish. Also, they tend to attack things that are in front of them and, and above them. So if you approach them from a, a different direction, um, you should be okay. Now, it's one thing to know that in theory. Um, it's quite another to put that into practice. And I found myself, I, I, was, I swam up to a, a couple of crocodiles in the water, lifted up their tails, and, uh, and lived to tell the tale. Have you ever said no to a proposal? Ooh, I've, I've thought long and hard sometimes. Um, th there was one occasion, um, we were filming in South Africa a few years ago, and th there were large bull sharks in this river in South Africa. And what was interesting is that these, these sharks, were, they, they weren't interested in people. I mean, and um, I, I was going to swim across the river, but the director at the last minute said, no. Yeah, don't, we don't need yeah, to. We've proved yeah. our point. We have yeah. to run. All new episodes of River Monsters return Sunday night at 8 on Animal Planet. Thank you, Jeremy. Thank you, Jeremy. Pleasure. Mike.